economics class today we will discussing a new topic advantages and disadvantages of globalization in the previous session we discussed what is globalization and mlcs globalization is a process in which rapid integration or interconnection between countries in the world mlcs are play major role to strengthen globalization what are the advantages of globalization the first one the globalization it plays greater choice into the consumers the consumers have great advantage into the marketplace because variety of product low price product high quality products are available in the market before the entry of mnc or globalization in india very few products are available and the prices also comparatively uh, bigger than at present so nowadays in india the consumers they have greater choice into the market this is the first advantages of globalization the second one some of the indian companies they acquire the status of mncs due to the effect of globalization and stiff competition some of the indian companies are acquired the status of globalization examples tata motors infosys asian paints etc third one see once the indian companies are collaborate with the mncs the indian companies also have great advantages because the mncs are ready to spend more amount of money and they provided latest technologies and the indian products reach to the world market so they can get huge profit above all the due to the effect of globalization or mncs variety of job opportunities was created into the marketplace new industries was set up like the cell phone service and electronics these field the variety of job opportunities was created see these are the main advantage or merits of globalization in india at the same time the globalization it resulted some of the uh, demerits and disadvantages also first one the globalization it highly affected the life of small scale producers once the small scale producers they fail to compete with the mncs most of the time they shut down their units it resulted their life into dark the second one it is that many of the workers who are they earlier work in the small scale producers their industries many of them are fall into jobless their condition also miserable if the mncs are ready to provide jobs uh, it is not the permanent way temporary way only they are providing the jobs so the mncs it highly affected the small scale producers and the workers in our nation not only mnc due to the effect of globalization some problems was faced by the small scale producers and the workers the small scale producers they shut down their units because of the stiff competition in the market and uh, many of the uh, workers they are fall into jobless and they don't get any permanent job only temporary job was get by the people due to the effect of mncs and above all they don't get any fair uh, profit or benefit 
at the same time we can conclude this topic with one sentence that is the impact of globalization have not been uniform the impact of globalization have not been uniform of course it is right the impact of globalization was different it is differently affected the different sect of people in india the first one already we noticed that the consumers have great choice at the same time it highly affected the small producers as well as the workers in our country but at the same time some of the indian companies have great advantage they reach to the status of mncs like tata motors asian paints infosys etc but at the same time creation of cess or special economic zone it resulted many of the peasants they fall into landless and their future life was dark so in conclusion the impact of globalization have not been uniform dear students hope you understood well we can see the next session thank you